Oh, well, well, ladies and gentlemen, Alexander Hilly123 here, and it's time to continue Sonic 3 and Knuckles. Now on Sanderpolis Act 1 and 2, and I just clicked the stream button on accident instead of the capture button. <laughs> oh dear. But I have amended that now. Let's continue. It doesn't look like we're going to get all emeralds, which is a shame. That final emerald is really going to cost me, but oh well. I'm going to try and go for the big ring if I see it, but there's only two or three left now, I think, and obviously it's just going to be that same stage, unfortunately, but whatever. I had six emeralds as well for such a long time, which is a really annoying thing, but... Oh, well. Well, 13 lives again at least. I think especially in the second act of Sander Polis, Knuckles has a lot... Oh, look at that! Oh, God. Yeah, he has a lot of uh, alternative paths. It's quite a long level, and I remember when I was younger, sometimes hitting the 10-minute timeout on the uh, second act. Hopefully that doesn't happen today. But it is quite a lengthy level. But yeah, I said it before, earlier in the playthrough, and I've got to say it again. This is a level that has grown on me down the years. I didn't like it when I was younger. But I kind of do now. Oh god. And another good thing to say about this level is that both Acts 1 and 2 are very different to each other. Was that Act 2 were inside the pyramid itself? And there were ghosts and ghouls, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, I could have got crushed there. <laughs> And of course, needless to say, the music, <laughs> you know it, it's amazing. Oh god. You know one of those things haven't hit me yet? Going to happen next time, but there we go. They still haven't hit me yet. And they're very, very irritating enemies, those guys. I think that might. Oh god. I don't think I usually go this way. So I don't even know what's here. I will forget that. Oh no, I want them. I can't quite. Yeah. Hold on a minute. Yeah, I'm not sure I'm going to get to that. Whatever. No. <laughs> oh, God. He finally gets me, and it's actually accidental. Ooh! Ooh! I want to save the game, guys, just before I go in here. I know I hate myself for this, but... Basically, if I fail to do this, I'm going to load up a save state. I know, I know. It's bad of me. Modern gaming, but... This stage is destroying me. We're going to give it one go. And then I'm going to... Uh, possibly cheat. <laughs> I'm not sure right now. I've just, I watched a YouTube video of someone do this, but he got all the rings and he was proper MLG. And I don't know, this one is just really bothering me. I really don't see myself doing this.
Yes! Keep it MLG, ladies and gentlemen. Get in there. Wasn't expected to do that. Doing the old Ali G, uh... If you remember that back in the day. Knuckles can go to Hidden Palace. Oh, wow! What's all that about? Well, that's kind of surprised me because... If you get all seven emeralds as Sonic, it'll say uh, Sonic can now be hypersonic or whatever it is, you know, super, blah, blah, blah. And I'm pretty sure it's the same with Tails, but with Knuckles, it says that. Now, I know Hidden Palace Zone is where Knuckles stores the emeralds, you know, before that mechanised Robotnik stole them, I think. But we'll have to wait and see what that's all about, because... I'm pretty sure even if you don't get all the emeralds of Knuckles, then um, he still has to go through Hidden Palace Zone. So. Well, it'll be interesting to see what happens, though. And I think finally, we're here. <laughs> I've said it before and I'll say it again, as much as Sonic 3 and Knuckles is a great game, some of the bosses are a little peculiar, this guy included. But of course, you've got to remember that on Sonic 1 and 2, there isn't a boss at the end of the first act, so there's a lot more bosses on this game. I usually get hit once and usually just jump a little bit too high or low, but not so far. Okay, there we have it. Get that in the quicksand, and we're golden. I'm going to make a prediction as well that this is going to be the longest video in the playthrough, which I was expecting beforehand. But anyway, let's go through the Sander Polis Zone, Act 2. And those go Whoa, the ghosts are out already. They are out already, ladies and gentlemen. This is crazy. And the music's just that little bit more sinister as well. <laughs> it's absolutely brilliant. Oh god. Oh, how I wish Sega could have continued making great Sonic games like this. I remember seeing footage of an old Sonic game that was actually never released. I don't think it was released anywhere. I can't remember the name of it. But it was the first proper 3D game. Probably on the Saturn, I'm guessing. Although, like I say, it never got released. And it just looked terrible. Um, we're going to give this a go. But at the end of the day, I'm not that fussed right now kind of gives you an idea of how difficult this is though, especially with Knuckles, not so much with Sonic and Tails. But... As you can see now, we've got another three there, and three there, so I need to do another six. Obviously that one is a Super Emerald now, so we can't do that, we've already done it, but yeah, six more, and there's probably only one or two more big rings in the game. So, wow. The stages themselves are nowhere near as difficult as they are in the first two Sonics, but yeah. But I'm under no pressure here. It didn't say I could... It didn't say, sorry, that I got all the emeralds, but I'm pretty sure it's seven I need, so it's not eight. So I'm not bothered because... I'm not going to get all those super emeralds by the end of the game. Oh god, I've already messed it up.
There is actually a way when you connect Sonic 1 and Sonic and Knuckles that if you've got the cords, you can play tons of levels. And I'm telling you, there are absolutely loads. And not just the ones that are on Sonic 3 and Knuckles, but hundreds, if not more, of different levels. They're kind of like... Well, obviously made by the creators of the game at the time, but... Right, I'm getting lost here. I don't want this to happen. Hold on. Right, how do we start this? There we go. Yeah, obviously made by the creators of the game back in the day, but because no one probably used it like that, it's going to be very, obviously very new to most people. It's pretty crazy. I'm going to make a prediction that by the time I finish this level, it's going to be about eight and a half minutes. So it's going to be run pretty close. And of course, after this stage, it is Lava Reef 1 and 2. Lava Reef 2. In my opinion, it looks a lot better than Lava Reef 1, but overall, I prefer Lava Reef 1. And the music to Lava Reef 1 reminds me of a Tia Sophia song, I can't, I can't remember what it is now. Just one of those things that reminds me of it. I think it's Pale Shelter or something like that. The music is awesome, isn't it? Oh god. Knuckles not jumping as high as... A bit of a burden, really. Sometimes, yeah, there's an extra life there to the left, but whatever. Ooh, didn't quite get both of them. And uh, ladies and gentlemen, today I um, went out into a town centre near me and I purchased Doom Free, the BFG edition. And it was a kind of more local, you know, independent game store as opposed to CEX or a nationwide one. And um, which, to be honest, I would prefer to give my money to the local one, obviously. If the same game is there for the same price, you know. But... Um, I went in and they've got this little thing where on the counter we're going to get hit here. Yeah. <laughs> on the counter you can play a Mega Drive. I don't know why it was a Mega Drive. It's probably not always a Mega Drive. But yeah. There were two kids, about six or seven, and they were playing Sonic 2. And I, well, to be honest, I'd say that made my week. Oh my god. I'm, look at the background of that colour. <laughs> that green enough for you? But yeah, they were playing Sonic 2 and they were about 6 to 7 years old and um, seemed to be enjoying it and, you know, I said before that these games will never age, really. It's true, and I was just delighted to see them enjoying it so much, you know, because I was that age when I played this game for the first time. Probably the, the first game I ever played, <laughs> the first Sonic, so yeah, it was just fantastic. Anyway, 18 to go here. And to be honest with you, I don't really know where we're going here. There we go. 
I hate doing that. Right, so let's go right. No. <laughs> oh, God. I'm getting stressed now. I think I'm going to give it another 10 seconds or so and then I'm going to throw in the towel. Considering the fact that I know this this is a video that's been recorded here. Yeah, I'm going to have to throw in the towel. I think on my Sonic 3 and Knuckles playthrough, the longest video was about 18, 90 minutes. Actually, looks like we're going to get above that. Ooh, this is going to be fun to upload. It's probably going to be a gigabyte. But... It's not so bad because when I emulate it from a laptop, it's MP4 and YouTube do not like MP4 because it has to process a lot. Whereas this, I think it's a, what is it, a TPEG4 or something like that? A T <laughs> I don't know, as you can probably tell. But yeah, basically, it doesn't have to process this type of video, so... Even if it is over a gigabyte, it's not the end of the world. And I'm pretty happy with the speeds of my internet at the moment in terms of upload download. I'd say about a 500 megabyte video is taking about 20 to 30 minutes to upload onto YouTube. It's good enough for me anyway. I think I'm on form today. When I played this yesterday, if you don't know, well you won't know. <laughs> From the start of Sandopolis Act 1, is the second day I've been playing this. And uh, I felt like I was making a lot of mistakes, losing a lot of lives, and I think I've been on better form today. Oh, it's the same boss that Sonic faces. Oh, and it's that little bit trickier because, you guessed it, he doesn't jump as high. Get into my stride though, it's okay. Oh god! What happened there? Robotniks are charging his laser. Or his standings charging his laser. Oh yeah! Ladies and gentlemen, there we have it. Knuckles got through Act 2. And I'll see you in the next video. For the Lava Reef Zone, Act 1. We're getting close to the end now, guys. And we got all the emeralds. But I'm still uh, very curious to see what's going to happen in the Hidden Palace Zone. So, yeah, I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.